Tires can explode from overheating, general wear and tear, being made to carry too much load, or being put under too much stress. So if airplane tires have to carry very heavy loads, can be retreaded up to seven times and undergo at least 500 landings before each retread, and experience extreme stress and heat during every landing, why don't airplane tires explode? On the outside, an airplane tire may look a lot like any other tire, but in fact they are completely different. Composition In order to withstand the extreme stresses they have to, an airplane's tyres are made by combining layers of different materials. These materials are synthetic rubber compounds, aluminium reinforcements, nylon fabrics, steel reinforcements and aramid fabrics. Aramid fabrics are strong heat resistant fabrics used in ballistic related body armour and other military and aerospace applications. Conductive rubber the synthetic rubber used for airplane tyres is called conductive rubber, meaning that it can actually conduct electricity. On a modern aircraft, there are hundreds of electrical components and sensors that are very sensitive to electrical discharge. During takeoff and landing, the friction of an airplane's tyres creates static electricity. Should this energy suddenly discharge, it could interfere with or damage these sensors and have catastrophic consequences. The conductive rubber allows the tyres to conduct the electricity into the ground and therefore avoid a potential build-up of static and its subsequent discharge. Nitrogen Aircraft tyres have to be inflated to 14 bar in order to carry the burden of the massive aircraft above them. They also have to endure extreme pressure changes and drastic temperature changes. During a normal flight, a tyre's temperature can go from minus 40 degrees C to over 200 degrees C in a relatively short period of time. Normal pressurised air is affected by temperature change, it's corrosive and it's flammable. So in order to reduce the level of expansion and contraction that the the tyre suffers during these changes, reduce internal corrosion and lower the risk of an explosion or fire, airplane tyres are actually filled with the inert gas nitrogen. Safety measures Airplane tyres are also equipped with some pretty ingenious safety devices. As we mentioned before, aircraft tyres have to endure extreme pressure and heat. Even though they are filled to 14 bar, the tyre itself has to be able to withstand four times that pressure for at least three seconds in order to be deemed safe. In addition to this, most aircraft wheels are equipped with an OPRV, over pressure relief valve, to release the tyre's pressure should it exceed a safe level. Another safety device wheels have is a thermal fusible plug. This plug has a central core made from a metal that has a low melting point, normally lead or tin. Should the wheel or tyre exceed this temperature during a heavy braking situation, the inner core melts, slowly releasing the tyre's pressure and therefore reducing the possibility of an explosion and improving the braking by increasing the friction the tyre has with the ground. Circumferential grooves Airplane tyres don't have the intricate tread patterns that car tyres do, just some circumferential grooves. Oddly enough, this is also done to stop them from exploding. A tyre's tread is designed to evacuate water from the surface beneath it to increase traction and avoid aquaplaning. The horizontal tread that we see on a car tyre's design doesn't appear on an aeroplane tyre because the average aircraft's tyre hits the runway at 150 miles per hour and it must accelerate to that speed as it is dragged along the runway. This stress would literally rip the block-like car tyre tread from the tyre and possibly cause it to explode. Also, aircraft really have no need for the horizontal tread anyway. The horizontal tread is designed to evacuate water as we go around a bend, giving us traction when we take a corner at speed. Should you ever be in an airplane that's cornering at speed, aquaplaning probably isn't your biggest worry. Which of these facts surprised you the most? Let us know in the comments below.